so usually they're not going to tell you if it's translation, reflection, dilation, or rotation. They'll just say, what's the rule for the transformation? Well, for this video, we're looking at um, reflections and trying to find a rule for just reflection. So this is a generic direction, but we're going to focus on reflection. And you'll see that they have a mirror image between these two, and it looks like it's been flipped across a line. And that's the key that it has been reflected. So the best thing to do is find a point in this prime. There's J and J prime. And find where they meet in the middle. So you can see where we kind of creep up and meet in the middle. There's the point. Mark it. Maybe you put like a pencil mark right there. And then go find one other point in its prime. And I see I and I prime are pretty close. And they're going to meet right there. Once you've uh, found two of these meeting points, you know, using two different sets of, of dots there, um, basically you can just go and connect those two dots and that's your line of reflection. So the line of reflection here is um, the x-axis. So the rule would be, hey, reflect it over the x-axis. Same thing happens here. Even though it gets messy, go find your points in its prime. So there's M, there's M prime. Where do they meet? Right there. Mark it with a pencil. Move on to another dot. And even though it gets messy, just choose another set there. Um, N looks to be closest to N prime, so let's use that one right there. Okay, so where do they meet? Right there. So now I've got those two points that we've we found, and that is your line of reflection. Because it is a mirror image, they're crossing over each other. That's a sure sign that it's been reflected. So... Um, this rule is just reflect over the y-axis. Let's go take a look at a little bit harder situation here. And again, find the uh, two points there. And, uh, you know, the S and S prime look pretty good. Where did they meet? Uh-oh, it's not going to be an axis. Don't worry about it. They meet right here. Mark it with a pencil. Move on to another set. Um, try to get the dots that are closer to each other. So I see R and R primes a long ways away. Uh, why don't we just stick with the T and T prime? right there. That is the line of reflection. It's a horizontal line, so it's going to be y equals where it crosses the y-axis, which is actually uh, negative 1. need to fix that. There we go. What about this one right here? It looks like it's a mess, but do you see where they're crossing over to each other? That's not a translation. Not not really a, a rotation unless it was like a really messed up thing. So they look like mirror images with that crossing also. So it's definitely a reflection. So let's go do this. P would meet right here. Mark it. And let's use the Q and Q prime. See where it's hitting right there? Draw that line of reflection through those two points. What's the rule? Reflect across. And this would be at X equals 1. But Y because it's a vertical line that's crossing at the x-axis at 1 on the x-axis.